Number one, a similar lifestyle. You're going to enter a life together. Which life? What kind of life? What do you think life is? If you have very different opinions about it, you're not entering each other's lives. You're going to be competing. You're going to have a constant ongoing debate about life. Doesn't make for a good marriage. A woman meets a man, finds out what his life is all about, and says, I would like to be part of that. That's a marriage. You don't want to be part of his life? Then leave him alone. Then get out of his life. The same in reverse. A man meets a woman, hears what she thinks life should be, and he says, that's the kind of life I want to have. Now we can share a life. One life, because we have the same idea about what life should be. So the first thing is, do you have a life and you're inviting somebody into that life? Then you can get married. If you don't have a life, what are you inviting the other person into? A love affair? That's not going to last. Number two, even if you have matching ideas about what life should be, there's got to be something a little more personal that brings you together, and that is good chemistry. Now, good chemistry doesn't mean you're exciting, you excite me, you challenge me, you impress me. That's just chemistry. That's not good chemistry. Good chemistry means a man is sitting with a woman and he finds himself more comfortable with himself than he usually is. More comfortable being a man. More comfortable with the idea that he will take responsibility for a woman's future, everything about her life. He will gladly support her, protect her, work with her, be the man in the family. She's doing this to him. She's bringing out the male in him. Now, she's sitting with him, and she suddenly finds herself feeling very good about herself. She feels feminine, and that's him doing it. He is bringing out the feminine in her. That's good chemistry. Not how you feel about the other, how the other makes you feel about yourself. If you meet somebody who has the same ideas about life and the chemistry is good, you have met your soulmate. Don't go anywhere. Marry each other on the spot. Because <laughs> that's not going to happen with just any nice person.